looking at here is what's known as a standard stock tube train. It's got four cars. These sorts of uh, tube trains were built uh, from 1923 until 1934 by six different manufacturers. Therefore, the deep level tube, which you can tell from the shape of the front of this uh, car here. We could refer to these uh, tube trains as second generation tube trains. They followed the gate stock in which people had to get on and off the train through gates and it was followed by the 38 stock underground trains in the famous classic design. A prominent characteristic of the standard stock train is that the um, switching equipment was held in a compartment behind the driver so approximately one third of the uh, driving uh, car was taken up by this electrical gear and we see these louvers on this side um, surrounding that gear. This is painted yellow because towards the end of its life it was a, used as a pilot car on the underground system. What I want you to notice here is the doors. So these were the first trains to have air operated sliding doors which of course made it much easier to get people on and off the train at each, each station. And notice the doors reach up into the roof, which is a characteristic of tube trains, which we still see today on, on the current tube trains. This is uh, another driving car for this four car train. And here the panels are open and we can see the switching gear that was held in this part of the train.